YouTube, what's going on? This is actually my second take recording this video. I was interrupted by a phone call, which we'll get to in a second. But, if I'm following my, my plan, the title of this video should be something along the lines of a new pipe, a new tobacco, and a new beginning, or a new chapter, something, something dramatic like that. Reason being, this is almost for sure going to be my last video until I move, which is exciting for me. I know it doesn't change much for anybody else, but for me, it's a very exciting day. Long time coming. Um, I just got back from my favorite tobacconist, um, Tinderbox, in Costa Mesa, Newport area, um, if anybody's familiar. They've been around since like the 70s. Uh, great, great spot. Awesome. Love everybody who works there. Great selection. But yeah, it's fantastic store. Cannot recommend them enough. I don't. They might have a website. Uh, I remember looking at it once and thinking it was kind of not the best. Uh, they obviously focus on storefront. So, just got back from there, kind of as like my final goodbye, and I was like, kind of want to buy a pipe, you know, to to commend the occasion, to remember them by. Even though I've purchased plenty of them before um, from Tinderbox. You know, it's an excuse, it's an occasion. Why not treat yourself a little bit? So, while well, I light it real quick. The pipe that I purchased is this Maestro Geppetto Dublin. Smaller bowl diameter than I would normally go for, inner diameter at least, chamber. Um, it is a Maestro Geppetto Rust. Rusticato? Rusticato? It's rusticated, I think is what it says. So yeah, that's what it looks like. It's beautiful. Nice big pipe compared to a Zippo. It's pretty big. And I like it. I, I've looked at it in their case for probably six months. And given the chamber diameter, I was always like, yeah, it's not quite my thing. So I never bought it. But I decided today, why not? Tired of tired of thinking about it. In it, I am smoking a new tobacco to me. Probably nothing, uh, you know, it doesn't really deviate from the ordinary too much. Um, but it is a Cornell and Deal's Plantation Evening, which I love Bayou Morning. I love Bayou Night. I love Buffalo Soldier. That's probably my favorite blend of all time currently at least um it, that changes but buffalo soldier is probably my favorite from them um i've tried byzantium i've tried uh, anything cornell and deal especially the periques i love this is just another cornell and deal perique not to downplay it but it's really good it is really really good i've never heard of it so i figured why not bought the two tins they had was pretty confident I'd like it, given my history with Cornell and Deal Periques. This is a Perique Virginia Latakia with a sprinkle of Turkish. And it is nice. So yeah, those are the few updates. Should be my last video here in the state of California. Um, I am moving six to eight hours away to Northern Arizona, which is exciting been a long time coming got a house hopefully i'll be able to film a little bit more freely instead of in the backyard next to our trash cans but you know we make do yeah today is a uh, saturday day after black friday thank god they do black friday all week i'm so glad that black friday is not those gladiator matches they used to be it was horrible just brutal so Black Friday is not this depressing day of dread to me anymore. It's it's just a, it's just a day on the calendar. But yeah, it's the day after Black Friday, and uh, we move a week from today. We actually I don't know if anybody has moved recently. Sorry, I'm messing with this so much. This tobacco is very wet. I didn't let it dry out, so I'm gonna be fighting it for this half bowl while I break this thing in. Um, anybody who's moved recently, U-Haul actually has this system called the U-Boxes which are miniature, like 12 by 12 
12 by 10 storage containers that they drop in your driveway just with a forklift. Um, you pack them, they grab them, they store them, and when you're ready to move, they drop them off at your location. It's not the cheapest route ever, but when you have a lot of stuff like we do, a lot of furniture and things like that, especially going across state lines, multiple trucks would have been a few thousand dollars at least. So doing this way kind of actually saved us some money, um, but it's really great because they just drop them in your driveway. You load them. We had like two weeks to load them. Took our time, you know, go to <clears throat> go to another house that uh, the family has, grab some furniture from there, grab some family from her, or some family, some furniture from her family, things like that. Um, it was really cool. And then we actually had too much stuff. We overfilled it, or we had too, we, we, we filled all of them. So we just called them and said, hey, can you drop off three more? And they drop off three more. That easy. And they pick them all up and they're gone. It's a little nerve-wracking having like 95% of your stuff be in a U-Haul storage facility somewhere, but it's kind of what U-Haul does, so just got to have faith. They're also insured, which is nice. Apologies for the noise the neighbors are having a party. <clears throat> Big party. Whole neighborhood is no parking. But yeah, we are moving, which is exciting. I keep talking about it. We've been talking about moving for about 10 years. Um, you know, it, it's a big deal, but it's not, I don't know. I don't like to uh, repeat myself on things if I can help it. And I know I keep bringing up the moving thing, but I'm just excited to be honest with you. Um, anyway, that's it, I'm just looking forward to it. And that's that's what I've got going on. That's that's what the whole YTPC is about, It not it? It's It's, checking in on people kind of sharing some personal stuff as deep as you want to get or as shallow and uh, sharing a pipe together that's I mean, isn't that the point you know what i mean but yeah that's pretty much what i got as a giveaway update i am still doing the giveaway i'm not super active on youtube right now just because of how much stuff i got going on but i am doing the giveaway still and uh, kind of just trying to give it time. You know what I mean? I, I really want to get as many entries as I can, not for any personal promotion reason, but just to get enough people entered. You know what I mean? It's, it's a really nice pipe, nice empty tin of tobacco. So I, I want to, you know, give them as much opportunity as I can. And uh, I really enjoy hearing from people. So that's what I got for you guys. Uh, hope you enjoyed the quick update, and I'll see you guys in Arizona. Have a good one.